It's about a boy who's obsessed with videos, in particular viral videos. Um, and uh, he goes to a boarding school in the Northeast. And uh, he joins an audio video class where he's assigned to do kind of B-roll, as the instructor tells him, uh, footage of like hallways and classrooms and sort of just day-to-day -day stuff. And so he does this. and. Uh, by chance, he witnesses something, a death, and uh, and then it's about the way that the school deals with the death and how the boy deals with it. In particular, particular how the boy memori memorializes it versus how the school wants to memorialize it. Just because it was about a high school and it was a tragedy in a high school and everybody was going to compare it to Elephant, and I guess Paranoid Park, but I never saw Paranoid Park, so I'm not sure. I heard it was visually different, though, so, th so I don't know about Paranoid Park. But I knew that it would probably get compared to Elephant. For me, honestly, Van Sant, as much as I like Elephant, wasn't um, the greatest uh, or the most important inspiration for the film. Stuff like Chantal Ackerman's Gene Dillman and, and the idea of, you know, watching life unfold very naturally and taking that sort of uh, stepping back and just sort of being a fly on a wall. Um, and then more recently, people like Hanukkah. Um, you know, particularly because Hanukkah is so focused on this idea of the media and how we relate to the media and how, and then particularly how we, how video, uh, how videos change the language of the media in some ways. Another really wonderful French filmmaker that I don't think a lot of people know, which is Bruno Dumont. And unfortunately he's not, I mean, he, even in France he doesn't get as much attention as he should, but he, uh, I mean, his films are so powerful and, uh, his, his way of, uh, or his language of film is something that really struck me, particularly in Humanité and, and Life of Jesus. The, the film is told through a very particular lens and a very particular direction uh, and very concentrated on a certain view. Um, and uh, the idea being that, um, you know, I, I don't know what the final result is or, you know, what what the uh, outcome of this sort of new technology is in the sense that there is access to any sort of video or any the, anything you can imagine. You sort of just dip your hand into a bucket and you pull it out and you can find it. The idea of the film is really not just an American one. It's sort of just a generation that's growing up with access to any kind of image that they want. And what's different about it than say going to the movies or watching TV is that what you're watching is a piece of life. People when I go to France or other countries they ask they ask questions like uh, or they just make statements like now I'm scared to go to America. Well I go I don't know you know 